Good evening, good evening, Kingdom King and Priest Peter Spencer, Wisdom Speak. I love you, my brothers and sisters. I love you. And I pray today you have a wonderful day. I'm coming out of love. Uh, many of us deal with generational things we don't understand, be it curses, patterns, uh, uh, contracts, things. We, we have no clue what happened. Um, and so we have to go to the most high God. We always got to seek first the kingdom of God and his righteousness to help us to cleanse and clear some of this stuff up. So my brothers and sisters, with that being said, like I said, seek first the kingdom of God and his righteousness in the name of Jesus. So with that being said, let us go to the throne of grace. We corporately cover this prayer in the shed blood of the Lamb of God, which was slain on the cross, but is now risen and seated at the right hand of God and make it righteous intercessor for us. And with that same blood, we wash our robes clean and pure in the name of Jesus Christ. Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, we come to ask to release, purge, and purify us from all generational patterns that's plaguing us in this journey as born again believers and followers of Jesus Christ. For we have picked up ways of our earth and fathers, which has showed us ways contrary to your will and purpose for us. Some of these patterns is causes us to not walk in the full power and potential that you have placed in our life. Some of the patterns is making us miss grand opportunities and destiny that has purpose. So help us, Lord, to be pure and righteous and cleansed from generational patterns is totally keeping us from receiving from the kingdom of God. We repent of these generational patterns of our forefathers and renounce it right now in the name of Jesus Christ. And we bind it up from any generation moving forward in our family tree in the name of Jesus Christ. Then, in the name of Jesus the Christ, loose the righteous healing of the kingdom of God. Patterns to live as you called us out of darkness into your marvelous light. And give to us the abundant life that Jesus Christ went to the cross to die, buried, and rose on the third day is now seated at the right hand of you, Holy One. Make an intercession for us that we may live the patterns of the kingdom of God and your righteousness, that we will inherit the kingdom of God. So God the Father, renew our hearts, our spirits, our soul, and our minds, that we may know that good and perfect will, God, that we will be transformed by the renewing of our mind. Let us know that in the spirit today, as we ask, seek, and knock at the door of the kingdom today, in the name of Jesus Christ, we pray and ask, amen, amen, and amen. Wisdom speak. You have an awesome and wonderful night, kingdom. I love you.